Hello. In this video, I'm going to summarize the partial reduction reactions of carboxylic acid derivatives. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to start by choosing an acid chloride. Acid chlorides undergo partial reduction with lithium aluminum trioxyhydrides to form aldehydes. This reaction also works with anhydrides, though is problematic because in an anhydride, well, in a symmetric anhydride, we're kind of okay, though one part of the anhydride doesn't get reduced. If we have a non-symmetric anhydride or a mixed anhydride, it's not clear that it's easy to control which uh, carbonyl group in the anhydride gets reduced. In other words, which one is the electrophile and which one is the leaving group. And so generally this variation is considered not productive. Carboxylic acids are challenging to reduce uh, to the corresponding uh, aldehyde, but esters can be through the use of diacetyl aluminum hydride, followed by acidic aqueous hydrolysis of the uh, acetal like intermediate. And just like all other reactions of esters, this alcohol thing comes off as a leaving group. And then Diisobutyl aluminum hydride also reduces amides and aldehydes to alcohol, or amides and nitriles to aldehydes as well. <clears throat> this amide can be reduced to the aldehyde, and in addition, uh, nitrile can be reduced to the aldehyde. Here is a summary of the partial reductions of the carboxylic acid derivatives. Um, lithium, alum, lithium aluminum trioxyhydrides reduce acid chlorides and anhydrides to aldehydes. It is a weaker reducing agent, therefore it's more selective. It reacts with the more reactive carboxylic acid derivatives, but does not react with aldehydes. Then disobutyl aluminum hydride reduces esters, amides, and nitriles. Since it's an electrophilic uh, reducing agent, it can reduce these less reactive carboxylic acid derivatives because they are better nucleophiles than aldehydes and ketones, and because they tend to form an intermediate that does not immediately decompose and requires aqueous workup in order to form the aldehyde. So this ends the summary of the partial reduction reactions of carboxylic acid derivatives to aldehydes. Thank you for watching.